So coffee blurs. I'm brand new friends at City League. Send me some coffee. <laughs> They spoke my love language when I tried a sample of their, of their what? Right. Their zombie anaerobic that had notes of juicy raspberries. It was sweet and whiny, strong emphasis on the juice. But along with this guy, they sent me some of their new Ethiopia coffees. The washed version, which has notes of jasmine, vanilla, lemon lime, black tea, the natural version of those beans to compare with notes of chocolate covered berries lemon and mango okay all right calm down i'm gonna try your both <laughs> new beans i do dream let's start with this washed version i feel like it's a little citrus and some, some tea oh we gotta try it you know we got to try it we got to brew it up Nothing Let's start with this washed Ethiopian. Get some notes of tea, as promised. We got sweetness, like a vanilla sweet. Right after that, the natural. Mm. Reminds me if this song, the anaerobic that I already tried and fell in love with, is like a wash. It's got a good body, I'll tell you that. But damn, definitely some tea elements. I get like kind of the bitterness of the jasmine tea. I mean, I'm not a fan of jasmine tea. So it's good this doesn't just taste like jasmine. But damn, okay, the vanilla, it adds a little bit of complexity. The vanilla to me is what makes this. The astringency is very tea-like. Okay, let's try the natural. The, uh, the fruit part is what reminds me of that juicy raspberry coffee. I wouldn't have guessed mango. There it is. As it cools, I'm getting some of the mango in the natural. And as both cool, they share a lemon-like astringency, but the tea qualities are still stronger in this washed version, which I like. So as they cool, I'm finding myself preferring the washed. The wash is tasting more like this bazooka gum that they sent me. I've actually never had bazooka gum, so I don't know, but it tastes more like I imagine the bazooka gum to taste like, so. Mm. So yeah, okay, that is interesting. I mean, right off the bat when it's fresh and hot, even before I brewed it, I preferred the natural for sure. And I got those chocolate notes and definitely those cherry, not quite raspberry, but almost notes in the natural coffee. As it cools, I'm getting more of the lemon and I'm not a fan of lemon. So if I was gonna drink this quick or, and I don't drink coffee fast, I like to take my time. If I was for sure gonna be keeping it hot, I would be going with the natural. If I knew that I was gonna be lazy and not want to bother reheating it and just kind of sip it throughout the morning, I would be going with the washed. I'm finding it's quite tasty as it cools. Yeah, this is more like bubble gum, even with its tea qualities. Okay, what? It's, and this I'm feeling like, feels like marshmallow on my tongue. Feels a little bit lighter. Thanks again, City League, for these coffees. I'm gonna be mm, enjoying the hell out of these. Cheers. No, camera's over here. Cheers. <laughs>